Demo 7.5 Review Storage Bins and Display Stock in Storage Bins In this demo, we will view a storage bin as well as stock in storage bins. Use the SAP Easy Access menu to navigate to the transaction. Alternatively, enter transaction LS03N in the command field to access the transaction directly. For this demo, we will use the SAP Easy Access menu to navigate to the transaction. First, expand the Logistics menu by clicking on the arrow next to the menu label. In the Logistics menu, expand the Logistics Execution menu. In the Logistics Execution menu, expand the Master Data menu. In the Master Data menu, expand the Warehouse menu. In the Warehouse menu, expand the Storage Bin menu. In the Storage Bin menu, select Transaction LS03N Display. The system displays the Display Storage Bin screen. We need to select a warehouse number, storage type, and storage bin to view. Click the search icon next to the Warehouse Number field. The system returns a list of the possible warehouse numbers. Select San Diego Warehouse 100 and click the Enter icon. Next, click the Search icon next to the Storage Type field. The system returns a list of the storage types. Select Shelf Storage 001 and click the Enter icon. Finally, select the storage bin you wish to display. Click the Search icon next to the Storage Bin field. The system displays the storage bin screen type star 000 in the storage bin field. This will narrow the search results of the storage bin ending with 000. Click the Enter icon to view the results. The system returns a list of the storage bins that fit the search specifications. Select the appropriate storage bin. In this demo, we will select STBN1000 and click the Enter icon. Click the Enter icon to display the storage bin data. The system displays the data for the selected storage bin. The Store Bin tab displays data such as the storage section, storage bin type, number of quants, maximum weight, and status. It also displays data about the material in the storage bin. Click the Search icon next to the Storage Section field. The system returns a list of possible storage sections. Click the Close icon to return to the Display Storage Bin screen. Next, click the search icon in the Store Bin Type field to view the options for the storage bin type. The system returns a list of storage bin types. Click the Close icon to return to the Display Storage Bin screen. Click the Stock tab. The Stock tab displays the material that is in the storage bin and the quantity of material. Along with the storage location, the material is located in Inventory Management. Click the Bin Sectioning tab. The Bin Sectioning tab displays the number of quants in the bin, the number of storage units, and the maximum number of storage units the quants allowed in the storage bin. Click the Statistics tab. The Statistics tab displays data such as the transfer order number, last movement date, last change date, and the person who last changed the bin. Click the back icon to return to the SAP Easy Access menu. We will now view the bin status report. In the Logistics Execution menu, expand the Internal Warehouse Process menu. In the Internal Warehouse Process menu, expand the Bins and Stock menu. In the Bins and Stock menu, expand the Display menu. In the Display menu, select Transaction LX03, Bin Status Report. 
The system displays the bin status report initial screen. Click the search icon next to the storage type field. The system returns a list of storage types. Select Shelf Storage 001 and click the Enter icon. Click the search icon next to the Storage Bin field. The system displays the Storage Bin screen. Type star 000 in the Storage Bin field. This will narrow the results of the search bins that end with 000. Click the Enter icon to execute the search and display the results. The system returns a list of the storage bins that fit the specifications established in the search. Select the appropriate storage bin. In this demo, we will select STBN1000 and click the Enter icon. Click the Execute icon to view the bin status report of the selected storage bin. The system displays the bin status report overview screen. The report indicates that there are EPAD 1000 in the storage bin. Click on the Type field and then click the Details icon. The Detail Display screen shows data such as the material plant, number of quants, quant number, last movement, and total stock. Click the down arrow to view the rest of the data in the Detail Display. Close the Detail Display screen by clicking the Enter icon. Next, double-click the storage bin number to view the data located there. The system displays same data as displayed earlier in this demo. Click the Select icon to the left of the Material field. Click the Quant icon. The system displays quant data such as the weight, quant number, document number, goods receipt number, and the last movement date. Click the Additional Data icon. The Additional Data screen displays the last stock removal and stock placement date, as well as the last addition to stock. Click the Continue icon to close this window. Click the Back icon to return to the Overview screen. Click the Back icon to return to the Bin Status Report Initial screen. Type 002 in the Storage Type field and select the appropriate storage bin number. Details on how to search for these data were provided earlier in this demo. Click the Execute icon. The system displays the bin status overview screen. The report indicates that the bin is empty. Click on the Type field and then click the Details icon. The Detail Display screen displays data such as the maximum weight, storage type, and storage bin type. Click the Enter icon to return to the Overview screen. Double-click on the Storage Bin number to display the Storage Bin data. Demo 7.5 Review Storage Bins and Display Stock in Storage Bins